Yo, what's up everybody, it's boy Jeffrey from Jeffrey's World and welcome back to another abandoned crazy exploration. I'm currently standing at the top floor of an abandoned Krankenhaus, which is German for mental hospital. And it's just starting with lightning outside, so this will get very creepy. The whole place is actually damaged. Everything is gone, but it's super big. This Freaky hospital, super big fans. And yes, it was been a while since I explored an abandoned hospital. Right now, it's time for another one, and I cannot wait to share this one with y'all and to see together what is all left behind. But I'm not gonna show you the whole place, I'm just gonna show you the most interesting parts of this creepy hospital. And the creepiest part is there was only one way in. And we got that way in from a German who actually explored this whole building all by itself. On the freaky other side of the road, there is also a living uh, building where actually patients could live or something. I don't know what the heck happened there, but he told me that. And it's all from the same hospital. So it's probably from the, this hospital, abandoned as well. It just started like thundering, so this will be getting crazy, man. Wow! All right, smash a big ass like, make sure to subscribe for more abandoned places. And here is a quick preview of the buildings. Look, only we in, it's through there. And we have to walk to the basement to get out of the building as well. And in the basement to get into the building. Here I'm now standing at fans. So yeah, I'm ready for it, let's do this. So the clothes are pretty dark, it's, yeah. A storm will happen soon because you already heard some thunder and lightning. And we are here in the freaking abandoned mental hospital. <laughs> I hope all the things will happen. Yeah, if something happens, fam, it, it happens. So please, if you're gonna hear or saw anything in the background, please have in the comments below which time, fam. And also, if you can, take a screenshot of it so you can check it out by myself and me share it on my social media. All my social media is in the description below as well. So make sure to follow me there also so you're never gonna miss anything new. All right. Let's go straight to the exploration fam, so we have some more to do. I'm ready, let's do this. All right, enough talking. So, there's actually now the third floor, which is actually the last floor fam. And look at the hallway. It's pretty creepy actually. But it's so sad, it's, yeah, pretty damaged. Probably by vandals. And I think they're gonna demolish this building very soon. But, look at this. It's like an hospital from The Walking Dead. But the corridors are looking creepy, actually, in my opinion. And all the rooms are empty, so I'm not, not going to show you all the rooms, maybe a few. So, this is probably we're not good bored. But there are some gravities also, and you can see pretty messed up gravities on the walls. Here's actually also a lot of water damage I'm going to show you to right now. Check this. A smaller side building of the hospital also. I think I heard some music, but I'm not sure. Here are some elevators, fans. Also, I already explored an abandoned hospital with the power still on. I did a freaking 3 a.m. that was freaking intense. And the elevators was working as well. I will put that video link in the description. If you haven't saw it already, you must watch, fans. You won't regret it. So look at this. Yeah, it smells bad here inside the elevator right now. Alright, we're gonna show you first this. Before going back to the corridor, I are started this. So this is actually a fire door or something. Alright, look at this fans. It's pretty messed up here right now. And there's water dripping from the freaky ceiling. That's not good. Because that will collapse if it will have a lot of pressure or something from, from the water. It can collapse. So yeah. But the corridor looks sick in my opinion. We already heard some crazy noises actually. Creepy noises as well, especially at the basement. The basement is actually the creepiest part of this whole building. But now it's daytime. So I believe at night time this whole building will be very intense and creepy. Oh shit. Holy shit, it's gonna help me. Oh my freaky god, I just saw this door moving by itself, literally fans. What the hell is this? That is definitely not by the wind, man. Because the door is pretty heavy. I'm hearing some voices. Psst. Hey. 
Hey, who are you? I heard some voices. There are people inside. Great. I just heard some main voices. I freaky saw the door moving by itself. I'm just caught in the corner. I'm pretty sure of it. But I just heard some male voices. I don't like that. So we are probably not alone here anymore. All right. What? Where are they? Some more people? Yeah. Photographers? Hello? Hello? Uh, Urbex? Uh, English? English? Yes, um, the entrance is... Uh, around the corner and uh, you have to go through a small window that is open there and you have to go to the basement and then you are, have access to the whole place welcome I hope they understand me because I was standing on the top floor so it was actually some more Urbex people nice I didn't know this place was so popular by an Urbex community so yeah but we have to say the entrance actually to them. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna wait here? I'm gonna show you the rest of the building real quick. Okay. So it is actually a hospital bathroom here, friends, for the patients, you know. This was a bathroom they had. Oh, the cobwebs. Freaking hate them. Ugh. Ah, it's stuck on the corner, Jesus. A tiny bathroom. <laughs> Look. Oh shit, stupid things. Oh, it's getting out of me. Alright. So, when I was saying <laughs> the entrance to the people who actually tried to get in, I think um, I had a lot of wind noise because it was pretty windy then. So I'm very sorry, sorry for that, fans. My apologies for that. Right, still at the third floor. The last floor looks. Oh, this is so weird to see a freaking VC like this. I mean, toilet. Kind of creepy. All right, I wish I could understand freaky German way better than I do now. But glad most of the Germans are speaking English also here. So yeah, that's good for me. So they can understand me and I can understand them. <laughs> Alright, so this is actually the building I was talking about at Winter Road Farms for the patients uh, where they actually, yeah, live there. Look at this, it's a pretty big ass building also. It's from the same property of this abandoned hospital I am now at. Alright. Alright, I'm now gonna show you the second floor farms, not the whole second floor, but I found some interesting rooms that you definitely must see. So we're not alone anymore because those people actually found a way in another way in that I said to them. So yeah, basically they went to a very tiny hole. <laughs> I won't do it by myself, but if they did it, well, they are savage. But anyways, it's nice to know we're not alone anymore, so yeah. But I freaking saw the door moving, which is kind of creepy and that comes definitely not by the wind, so yeah. All right. Second floor, baby, let's do this. Check this out, fans. All right, so actually the best things about this whole hospital is just the corridors, actually. If they build still some hospital beds left behind, this will be amazing. But they aren't, so that's sad. But does matter? Corridors are creepy as also. So, okay, this was actually the room I want to show you, fam. Check this out. It's a sort of office or control room area, I don't know. Let me know what you think. Here is actually some to storage from medicines. Glucose. So, I don't know what the hell this all means. My screen is blurry. I don't like that. Alright. Alright, it won't fix on that, Jesus Christ. Maybe now? Alright, good. 
Nice. So sad it's so damn it's here. Such a shame for such a big ass and beautiful building actually. So there's maybe a sort of control room. Look some maps. Nothing special. Probably for an X-ray picture, who knows? Alright, nice. Some loggers for the employees, maybe. So here, there's actually an emergency exit, a very strange as door. The reanimation area here, like in the ceiling door. It says reanimation. Watch out, the door is heavy. All right. Oh, toilets for the patients. Also destroyed. Sad. Mm -hmm. Personal. Mm -hmm. Some two more toilets. It's actually not that special here, but anyways, yeah. Some more elevators there, the blue ones. Cool. All right, we just heard a very loud thunder. <laughs> Freaking thunder bang. That was literally kick ass. I hope you're gonna hurt whilst I am recording because I was too late to record, so yeah. This is very, very loud actually. Jesus. <laughs> we are here inside this freaky and bad mental hospital. Anyways, if one, if you want to see me doing more 3 m challenges at the Banner Hospitals, let me know in the comments below. You know what to do, fans. I'm gonna reply to everyone. At least I'm gonna try. But mostly I reply to everyone, so yeah, because I love to read all your comments and to read your support. That means a lot for me also, fans. Alright, time to a, a lower floor, which will be the first floor. Alright, let's go. So I think next floor is the main floor of my opinion. I hope so. Go to basement. Who knows? We're gonna see it later fast. First this beautiful floor here right now. With yes, another creepy corridor to start this explore of the 3D first floor. I actually don't have a clue which floor this is. <laughs> I always have problems in uh, many hospitals to know which floor we now at. But I guess it's the first floor, maybe. Who knows? We're gonna see it. Maybe we're gonna find some evidence. Which floor we now at? So yeah. Ah, okay. So this is the first floor because that is actually the main floor, fam. And this here is actually the main entrance. So yeah, that's cool. Okay, this is the first floor. Found some evidence already. Nice. Stupid things. Links for rechts. It's a little bit like Dutch, but this is German. So it probably means left for right, you know? Now you know something more. All right. All the tiny bathroom, the all, like I said, all the freaky rooms are similar like each other. So nothing special. Oh, no way. Are you kidding me, man? It's just started uh, raining. I hate freaking rain. Why? This needs to happen right now. Always same thing. We, at least we had some good weather in Germany, hopefully, but it will get clear outside again in a few minutes. So, yeah. Because I don't want to get wet and be like a freaky water chicken, you know. 
this it's like blood holes nice so I think those people are still at the freaking basement but I don't have a clue if there is a freaking mark here or not probably it could be here a mark but not all the abandoned hospitals has a freaking mark I think At least, at, I only explored one hospital with a creepy morgue and I was laying into those creepy ass bats, you know, the freezer actually. And I've got on the video also, so I'm gonna put that video link in the description also, if you want to see that part. Alright. I know, I'm sorry that I'm not going to show all the rooms, like I said, they are just empty, nothing special vibes. I hate tricky rain, you know that? Oh, Jesus. Ah, okay. It's time for the main floor right now. So we are now created the main floor. And I think the basement is going like to there, I don't know, wait. I think the basement is here right now. All right, so look at this fence. It's there for the basement, but that's what it is. I like the same fence. The basement is the creepiest part of this whole freaking hospital fence. Why the heck is this freaking door locked right now? Jesus Christ. Alright, through the door then. We don't have any other choice. Only this one at the moment. Sorry. Who cares? Another creepy ass corridor or the freaking main floor. Which is this? So it has been a sort of cafeteria here. A kitchen? I don't know. Friends, let me know in the comments below what you think this building is or was. For what they use this here and now. It's kind of strange. You freaky won't believe what we now just found. I was just telling about a morgue. I think we found a morgue. Look at this. And I thought this was a freaky kitchen area or a cafeteria here. But this here, right now, fans, I think that is actually some freezers where they're actually laying the bodies in. But. <laughs> Mork time, baby. Are you kidding me? Dude. <laughs> That's kind of strange. What is this? Is that not a mork or what? It looks like the mork. Who knows, we're gonna find it inside for now. What the heck should this be? Fam, if you know what the heck this is, let me know in the comments below. I really thought there was a morgue. So there's actually some China still. But those must be some freezers, I don't know man. Strange. Okay, it's strange. So I think no morgue. Hmm. Why? I thought he had another mark, but mm, that's a big ass fell. It really looks like freezers from a mark, actually. Look. What the hell is this? Come on, fans, let me know in the comments below what you think what the heck this is. This is not from a mark. I don't know what the heck this is, actually. But it's locked. Why the heck is this locked? 
Oh wow. Nice. Do you see what I see? Staircase that goes to the freaking basement fabs. I hope you're gonna find my way out. Oh, it is gonna scare me at the moment. Like I said, the basement is freaking huge. And we're gonna find a mark inside the basement, who knows? Because a mark is mostly at the basement, I think. Alright. From now on, you have to pay attention to the background vibes. Because basements can be haunted like crazy. Alright. Word. This word, literally word. Still going, but hmm, what special thing? All right. Walking through a corridor of a very creepy, ginormous basement. <laughs> Why not? Okay, it's like they are all generators here. Look some windows. That's open. Crazy. For the mechanics maybe, I don't know which type of rooms those are actually. It's kind of hurt. But I think I have gone to speed this up because my battery is flashing, it's almost empty. I forgot my own battery in the freaking car. Stupid ass I am. Right, hopefully we're not going to get lost here. Okay, that's creepy to read this. 666, die, 420, nice. It's a bird. I have a question for you. Have you ever explored a basement from a man hospital? Let me know if you're a savage like I am right now. Pentagram with another 66 symbol. Nice. <laughs> Alright. Good, 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 good. Where are we now? Don't tell me there's a freaking dead end here, my right man. Cool. Hello? Don't tell me we are lost in the freaking basement. Oh, okay, okay, good, good. Mm -hmm. But we don't use the stairs, we have to go through the basement. See? Alright, good, good, good. I remember this. We came from here actually. And yep. <laughs> so storage room maybe. Look how creepy this is. This looks straight out of a freaking horror movie. Like the pipes. This does me remind a little bit of the basement from the movie Grave Encounters, in my opinion. Okay, I remember this. He actually used the stairs. But first I want to show you one more last thing before I'm going to end, end this video right now, fans. It's through here. Right. Mm -hmm. First, get your place here, man. Creepy also. But the little function very very creepy actually. And when I'm watching at this freaking hallway, it has me a very very nice feeling. You understand why.
think it's through here, yeah? Nice, nice, nice. This is through here. But this hallway here is circular or what I have. It is a bit I might want to go for it a little bit. It's a bit more. But I really want to know what the heck this is. It's super weird here. Mm -hmm. This is weird. The big ass echo. Creepy. Alright, last corridor. Yep. I'm not in the basement anymore. I'm now on my way to the exit. I found it right now. It's, I think, right here. Alright, you will go first. Because it has top rained. And I really want to show you the building from outside quick before it starts raining again. <laughs> Hopefully not. And I checked it out, Hams. Creepy, eerie room. I really hope nothing will grab my ass or something. That's actually the last thing I want. Oh, stupid, freaky hospitals. Look, oh, oh, take the camera. <laughs> I have not good grip anymore. It's still recording, nice. Nice, nice. Oh, shit. It was easier to get out of this and then actually going into this freaky building. This, the way it was not that easy. Good, fans, we did it. Nice! I smell some barbecue right now. Nice. Alright. Look. What a big ass hospital we just did. And yep, if you're wondering for how long we were inside, we were here for about a small two hours. Literally, two hours. But I'm glad the German who told us the way in has told us the way in because we were searching for about 15 minutes and then he showed up because he was actually exploring that building there alone but I'm not gonna do this Rams I think it's yeah I'm done here right now I'm glad I showed you this main building the main hospital itself and I can't, can't tell you this compound is massive but it will be sad they're gonna demolish this very soon so yeah look our vinyl view right now fans check this out very creepy hospital, but we did it! And that is actually the most important thing of this whole exploration. So if you enjoy this fams, smash a big ass like. I try to show you the best of this abandoned hospital, aka Krankenhaus in German. <laughs> so yeah, the only strange thing I got on camera was actually some red ass noises. And also the door that was moving by itself. I'm pretty sure I got on camera fams. Hopefully I did, but I'm 100% sure I have it on camera. So yeah, that's the most important thing as well. So smash that big ass like, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to enable my YouTube channel notifications so you're never gonna miss anything new. And make sure to follow me on social medias. Also, check out the hospital exploration already there at 1 at 3 a.m. and 1 at 3 a.m. also. We're actually late in the morgue. Nice, huh? That's savage. All right, it's your boy Jeffrey. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna see you another one. Peace.